5 Things We Want to See for Firstly in Outlander Season 4 Fiercely, Fergus and Marsley's ship name will be in Outlander Season 4. Their story will adapt slightly from the novels, but here are 5 things we want to see. Fergus and Marsley are adorable together. This is more than just a relationship but a partnership. It's clear that Fergus has picked up a lot from Jamie over the years and Marsley knows how she would like to be treated and isn't afraid to speak her mind. Fiercely, their ship name in the fandom, will be in Outlander Season 4 but in a slightly different way from the novels. With that in mind, a few storylines need to adapt. However, that doesn't mean we want them to completely change. These five events are focused on some of the stories from Drums of Autumn but with a slight twist to suit the changes at the end of Season 3. 1. Bonding time with Claire and Jamie Fergus is officially part of the Fraser family. Jamie made it clear that this young boy is his son, biological or not. That makes Marsley now part of the Fraser family through marriage. It's time for some bonding to happen between the parents and children. It's not going to be easy for Marsley, since Claire is sort of the other woman. After all, Marsley views Jamie and Larry as happy until Claire came along. Whether she knows the full truth or not is unknown. During the voyage to Jamaica, Marsley gained a little respect for Claire. She also sees that Fergus loves Claire as a mother and looks up to both Jamie and Claire. Bonding time between the four is needed. 2. Bonding time together. This relationship was thrust upon us. In the novels, they've had more time to adapt. Their stories have been told and we can see their relationship blossom a little longer. This isn't quite the case for the series. Outlander Season 4 needs to show more time of the two together. We need to see them bond and form that special connection that they have. This will give future storylines more impact. 3. Get their own place. For a time. The Frasers will all live together. However, as a married couple, Firstly will eventually need to move out. They'll need to stretch their legs a little. First of all, we need Fraser's Ridge to be created. Once that happens, Fergus can get a property on the land and the two can build their family. They should be one of the first to get a place of their own. Close enough to Claire and Jamie for love and support but far enough away to have lives of their own. This storyline is going to be important for the future. After all, they're the ones that seek life away from the Frasers. Voyager and Drums of Autumn made it so they learn to be away from the Frasers, and from each other for a time. They'll need to learn that in Outlander Season 4. 4. Their first child. As much as Marsley says she doesn't want to start a family yet, we know it's coming. The whole reason the two remain behind in Voyager is because of Marsley's pregnancy. It's not until towards the end of Drums of Autumn that Marsley returns with a baby in tow. Marsley may not be pregnant yet well, at least knowingly but it's bound to happen soon. By the end of the season, the couple should have a bouncing baby boy. Or is this something that's going to change slightly in the series? I certainly hope not. 5. Not to be forgotten. One thing I hope doesn't happen is that they're forgotten about, brought in when one or two extra characters are needed. They may not be the main characters, but they are important. Fergus shows how Jamie and Claire can love children who aren't their own, while Marsley shows how you can look similar to your mother but not actually be anything like her. There are also future stories that both are involved in, stories that are extremely important to tell, such as a depression storyline. Outlander Season 4 needs to give them a good storyline, especially since it's going to be different from Drums of Autumn. There's a bit of freedom since the two aren't around for most of the book.